So you know how on social media you'll see all of these fashion content creators or fitness content creators and they'll do these little try-on hauls and they'll show you, you know, the latest and greatest and what's out there. One thing that I've never seen is a DIYer do a try-on haul. So I'm gonna change that today because I just got a shipment in that I'm really, really excited about. So I'm going to do a little try-on haul, DIY edition. So I just got an order in from Duluth Trading, which this is not a sponsored post, although Duluth Trading, hit me up. I like you. But I'm gonna try these on, show you how they look, see what we think, give me some feedback. Also, if you're a DIYer yourself, let me know what you like to wear when you DIY, because you know, I need some help. I'm building my wardrobe here. All right, so this is the scoop neck, long tail tee in a stripe. I also love this tee because the sleeves are a little bit longer. I don't like a cap sleeve. I don't like a sleeve that's like, hey everybody, here's my armpit. Plus on the days that I don't get to shave my pits, you know, hides it a little bit. So, super cute. I like it. Okay, wait till y'all see these. They are so cute. These are their heirloom gardening bibs. They're so cute and they have pockets and pockets in the back and pockets on the side. There are so many pockets and they are so comfortable. They have this like ripstop material. They're stretchy and they are so, so comfortable. I just like that they're like, like I can move in these. You know what I mean? Like sometimes overalls are so stiff and rigid and sometimes you need that. Sometimes they're so stiff and rigid that like you, when you move, you're like, Arr! you know, everything's tight. This feels so good. And look how cute they are. I love them. Anyway, now this is their canvas bib apron. And it is so comfortable. It's like the straps are kind of padded, which is really nice. So just pull this, tie it up, and look, it's got like a nice little pencil pocket at the top, and then it's got a larger pocket. And then down here, we've got some pockets on the side. And my favorite part, ready? Pockets right here. Just for my hands pockets. Like this is such a comfortable apron. It's really a great, like, thick canvas, which is nice because I'm not going to worry about, you know, it getting damaged. Like, this is tough. Do I look like I'm ready to go make some stuff? Ready to go DIY? How cute is this? All right, I'm going to link everything in the description below. This stuff is so, so, so comfortable. I love it. Love it. Okay, so it's been a minute since I filmed the first part of the video. And because I did it and then I shared it on Instagram and everyone over there was like do more do more because I think a lot of people just want to know the truth about how some of these things fit so I ordered more things and I got more things in and I'm really excited to try them out and show you guys one of which how cute are these these are my eye protection but they look like glasses and it's a two-pack and it came with a tortoise shell or the black they're so cute, I love them. And I'm gonna link all of this, every single thing in the description below, so you guys be sure to go check it out. So some of the links in my description are affiliate links, which means I do get a percentage of the sales if you guys choose to buy them. All that means is, and it's a very small percentage, but that just means that when you guys shop through my links, it just helps support my channel and all of these little projects that I do on here. So. I would love your support. Okay, these are the Dickies cooling bibs and they're big. <laughs> like, there's room for another person in here, kind of big. I ended up getting the 3X in these just because I got the 3X and the Duluth and I thought, well, those were a little baggy but not too bad. These are huge but not so big that I'm going to return them. Like, I kind of like them because I can just you know, keep my jeans on and throw these on when I'm doing a project. So I love these. Real thin, 
kind of that ripstop kind of feel material. Very, very baggy, very roomy. Had to take my protective glasses off. Totally forgot that I was wearing them. Um, but these are really, really comfortable. Very lightweight. So these will be really nice, especially in the summertime, doing projects outside. I kinda like them, they feel good. Uh, this next pair is pink. And, well, it's pink. They're so cute. Okay, I'm sad. This is the 2X. So the largest size that this one goes up to is a 2X. Um, they, Oh, these go so far up my bootus that if I sit down, I will be split in half. This isn't happening. Like, see if these were pants, they would fit great. The problem is they have a really, really long torso, and these just oh, this is this is like this is like wearing overall thongs. Like this is straight up the bootus. This is not happening. And before anybody gets ugly and says, well, why don't you lose weight and then you can wear them. Um, losing weight is not going to shrink my torso. It might shrink it this way, but it's not going to shrink it this way. So don't come at me, tell me lose weight. I'm sad. Why do these, and, and listen, I've got these straps as long as they will go. They cannot go longer. And if they did go longer, the bib would be under my girls and that's just not gonna be very comfortable. You should have to go back. I'm sad. Oh, before we go any further, if you guys haven't had a chance, I would love it if you'd give this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. I love when you guys post comments. It's my favorite. I read through all of them. Y'all are awesome. Also, be sure to subscribe if you haven't. And if you are a creator, maker, gardener, human being, let me know what you like to create in. Like what? What do you wear to create? I'm still building this wardrobe, so I would love some tips. So that last pair, the pink ones, those are Dickies. And, and I am not knocking those overalls. Those overalls are adorable. I'm actually very jealous of anyone who gets to wear them because they're so cute. They just, I have, for someone with a really long torso, they just don't work for me. So I got this Henley from Duluth, and this is just, you know, for when it's cool out and I need something a little bit warmer, but y'all, I ordered more of the gardening bibs. This is that same gardening bib, but this is in raisin. But here's the difference. For all of my plus size friends, this is the 2X. Sorry, this is the double XL, which means this is in their regular sizes. And it fits. It actually fits really well. The other ones were a little baggy on me. These fit really, really well. And the good news is, is that the regular sizes come in more color options. Which, why do they come in more color options? Why do regular sizes get more options? Anyway, we won't fight that for now. But, this is the raisin. Now I will say, if a 3X is gonna work for you better, they also have the raisin in the plus size. The two colors you can get in plus size are the green that I got and then this color, this raisin color. But then if you go to the regular sizes, you'll see they've even got more. They even have patterns over there. So I am planning on owning every single shade because these are the most comfortable overalls I have ever owned. Now the reason these are more comfortable than the other ones is because the seat is gusseted. So like you can move, you can squat, you can bend over and you're not gonna get sliced in half. That is the key. So, Dickies, that pink pair that's so cute and lovely. If you would like really tall, long torsoed friends or plus size friends as well to be able to wear those, gusset that seat, gusset it. Let our bottoms have a break from that. Y'all know what I mean. Like you, those of you who have put something on and it's like, whoo, it's a little too much. That's that's where the gusseted seat makes all the difference. All right, I have one more thing to show y'all. My DIY fashion try-on haul will be complete, for this one anyway. Yeah. I need you guys to send me some recommendations. Like, do you have something that you love to create in that you think is so cute, so comfortable? It's gotta be both. Like, I can't just do cute. I need this to be functional. 
you know I need I need I need it to work so if you guys have some recommendations please leave those in the comments below these are my new muck boots how to make sure I don't have any, anything nasty stuck to the bottom of them how cute are these I love them they've even got the little strap in the back to help you yank them on they're so comfortable and they were not expensive. I got these on Amazon and they are a fraction of the price of the other boots that I've bought in the past. So again, I will link all of this, but look at the little blue detail. I love them. And then one more thing. This is a bonus item because even though I would not do any messy, messy DIY projects in this, how cute is this sweater? It's another new purchase and I love it so much. And I actually, I was wearing it on Instagram the other day and I got more messages asking me about this sweater. So I will link this as well. It is so warm and so comfy. So many cute things out there. And of course, no DIY project would be complete without a headband. I own about 5 million, which Get ready because I'm about to do a project very soon on a storage solution for all of my headbands because I've got a, quite a collection. But I'm always looking for more, so if you have any recommendations on good headband places, put it in the comments for me. I hope y'all had fun with this. I definitely did. I mean, you know, I had an excuse to shop, so if you need me to do this again, just let me know because I can, I can buy more clothes. I'll just, you know, I'll just tell my hubby, the people have spoken. I need to do more DIY fashion hauls. There's not much I can do about it. So I hope you guys have had fun. I hope you've enjoyed it. Make sure that you have yourself a little me time. And guys, I will see y'all next time. Bye.